So, hi, uh, my name is Annika Schmidt, uh, working for the Chamber of Commerce and Industry of Page Baranya as the head of the uh, Foreign Affairs Department. I'm also a member of the Enterprise Europe Network uh, Creative Industry Sector Group from ages. And the question is how to identify a good uh, apprenticeship coach. We actually have a lot of experience in this field. Um, I think that person uh, has to have, of course, as a basis, uh, very good technical skills for that specific uh, profession in creative industry uh, that he's doing, teaching, uh, mentoring. But, uh, and we see less in that field, uh, to have a lot of soft skills uh, in terms of communication, networking, a kind of openness for cross-sectorial uh, activities. So that person has to be really a kind of center of what he's doing with a lot of connections to have like a very wide range of activity in that field and to see the connections with other professions, with other companies, let's say. Um, because what we see now that these people are mainly old professionals having a really uh, solid uh, basis of technical skills, but really not having this kind of soft skills with networking, with uh, capacity building for themselves and then that way for the children, because they are really the bridge between the entrepreneurs, the employers and the, the children, the future workers or future entrepreneurs, that's not, let's not forget that. So these kind of skills, I think uh, uh, they need to become a good uh, apprenticeship coach.